Hey guys, Lethal Leslie here, and today we're going to be doing a hunting challenge on Red Dead Redemption 2. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be hunting for one hour exactly, and we're going to see just how much we can make in one hour. The target is definitely $100. We currently have nothing that we can sell to the butcher, which is where you sell everything that is related to hunting. You sell it all to the butcher online, so we have nothing right now that we can sell to him, and we also have $80 sitting there. So those are the things that we need to keep our eye on, as well as the time. The current time is 15.54, so let's get straight into it, I say, right now, and get on the hunt. So the weapons I have are the Vermint Rifle, the Bow, and the um, re Repeater, I think, are the three that I have. So I don't have a rifle in like a strong rifle to take down any big game so that's something we're going to have to deal with so you can definitely improve on what i'm going to be even do here just as a little side note guys but with that being said let's get into the hunt and let's see what we can do within an hour i'll make sure to give you guys time updates as well along the way all right we've got our first animal here north american raccoon down it goes so we'll have ourselves a perfect skin there damn damn that was an owl We'll have ourselves a perfect skin there, but we will not have ourselves, obviously, a perfect carcass. And we can only carry two carcasses at a time, so we won't be taking the carcass off this. We will just be taking the skin. So, you get a few, a fair few bits when you take a skin off an animal, though. As you can see, you get, what do we get? A perfect raccoon skin. Uh, we get some stringy meat as well. So, you get two things in that animal in particular, and we'll be selling it all. So, let's keep moving anyway. Oh, wow, missed him. Skunk here. Don't run over him, whatever you do. There we go. Got him with a third shot. We'll take it. Uh, it's a one-star skunk, which is a bit of a shame, but I'm sure it'll be a good condition carcass because I think it is the Vermint rifle that you hunt these with. A uh, good condition skin, I mean. We're not going to take the carcass again because it is a low-quality carcass. Got a rabbit here. Boom, we get it as well. Awesome. Now, rabbits are actually good value, and the Vermint kills them in mint condition. So if you get a three-star rabbit carcass... It's a really good quality. It's, I think it's three dollars and fifty cents, which is quite a good um, number, I would say, for a um, rabbit carcass. I'm going to hang on for now. Take a risk that we can get some three-star animals, though. So we're going to leave that there for now. Boom! There we go. I think we've got our first perfect condition animal there. It's a North American raccoon. Um, it's got some wild mint there. Won't let me do it. So let's uh, skin the North American raccoon here. By the way, I'm not going to show you every single animal just because. It'll probably just be too much if we end up showing everything. I'm also going to pick up the raccoon and stick it on the horse as our first animal that we're sticking on the horse as well, I think. We've got ourselves a skunk here now. That's pretty cool. I think this is a perfect condition skunk as well. It is. I wonder what a skunk is worth. Should we have a little look? Where is the skunk? Here it is. So this is going to be a $2.50 carcass as well. Oh, don't do this to me. There we go. We managed to get out of the water. Awesome. So now we are we have five dollars in the carcasses on the horse now because we've got two perfect condition carcasses on here. So we're gonna stone. We're gonna start heading back now for the first time, um, and sell up our first lot. So we're coming in here to the butcher for the first time. Let's see what we've got and let's just start selling everything. So we have one ninety there for the perfect skunks. A couple of squirrels that I didn't actually show you guys me catching. Uh, Three ninety for the whatever that was. The raccoon carcass, 250, not bad. Skunk carcass, 250. Coyote and coyote carcass, 210. So basically, off that, we started on 80 bucks. We've managed to actually make just shy of 30 on our first run. Before we head out, let's just check the time. So I would say, well, it's it's 10, it's 15 minutes, sorry, so far that we've been going. So if we can do something similar to that, we may be able to make around 120 on the whole run but there's no guarantees that you're going to make the same amount every time you go out of course so let's head out again and see what we can make on the second run we've got ourselves another raccoon now so let's see what quality this one is i, I think it was two star was it yeah two star raccoon that's the second two star raccoon we picked up on this second run now so not bad i think the we get perfect pelts for them anyway get ourselves a perfect conditioned rabbit which is great Oh, is that a, squ a squirrel there as well? Can I get that squirrel? Yeah, I'll have that as well. Why not? So we get a perfect condition rabbit, which is brilliant because you actually get around um, a buck for the skin and then you get 350 for the actual carcass of the rabbit. So this is like a really great find when you find a rabbit in perfect condition. We got ourselves an eagle there, guys. Not bad. Don't know what an eagle is um, worth or 
We might have a look in the book right now, see if it's worth me bringing with me. But we've found ourselves an eagle, which is pretty cool. So we'll go ahead and pluck it. we get some eagle feathers and stuff like that. It's two stars as well, so let me have a look. Good carcass is worth two bucks, so I'm actually going to take it because we've had a little bit of a bad run recently. Uh, it's worth two bucks. I'm going to go ahead and stole that on the horse and we'll move on to the next one. We've got ourselves one pig there. Should we try and get another? So we've got ourselves a boar here to finish off just right by the strawberry village or town, you'd say. So this would be the last animal we probably get on this one. Are you going to skin it or what? Is it just that tree too awkward for you? Yeah, pull him over. Let's get it. Do a fast one. Don't need to do the whole animation. So we're back at the butcher for the second time. Let's see how much we make this time. I doubt we're going to make as much as last time. It does not feel like it's been as good a run by any stretch. But, you know, you never know. Let's see what we get this time. So coming towards the end of what we have here now. And on this occasion, we have made... Do you know what? We've made almost exactly the same amount. We've made another 30 bucks, basically, just shy. But I think it's probably cost us a bit more time. What? 22? No, that cost us less time. It cost us 13 minutes that took us that time. So we still have like half an hour to go on this, basically. Just over half an hour to go. So let's get out there for a third try and see what we get on this occasion. One rabbit. Oh, come on. I want that other one as well. Two rabbits. Let's go. Two rabbits, guys. Awesome. I hope we get one in mint condition here. Perfect condition. Two star. Not bad. Not bad. I might just take both these rabbits back straight away or take both these as the animals that I'm going to stow on the horse, depending. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. It's early. I've just got out and I managed to get two rabbits instantly. So we're on the track of a perfect condition raccoon. Oh, here it is. Don't run over it. Whatever you do. Oh, I, yeah, I don't think I ran over it. Awesome, we got ourselves another perfect condition raccoon there. So that's a buck for the skin and another 250 for the carcass. So that's awesome. We've already got two carcasses on the animal now, so I'm probably going to just start heading back instantly in a minute as one of the fastest trips ever. I've only been out about two or three minutes. All right, we've got ourselves a deer here as the extra animal on this occasion. Uh, deer are some of the best animals to hunt on the whole game. Unfortunately, I can't get them in great condition at the moment because I don't have the uh, right uh, weapon for it. But I will definitely be hunting down a lot more deer when I do have the weapon for it. Let me just show you how much. Let me just check. Sorry, how much a deer goes for? Uh, it is currently in its best condition. It's seven bucks, but in its worst condition, it's two eighty, which isn't bad either. Which we've got in its worst condition here today. But you know, it's better than nothing. So we're here again, we're back at the Butcher for a third time now. We're going to sell up to him again and see what we do. We haven't got nearly as much this time as you can see. We've got 270 for all the feathers. We're going to sell that for 120, 25p. Three of them for 345, the perfect rabbit pelt. Uh, the meat sells decent, sell at 180. The bird goes for 240. We've got ourselves a squirrel. For a buck, 250 for the raccoon and 250, uh, 210 for the rabbit. We get a 280 for the poor deer carcass and then we get 90 for the poor deer pelt. And yeah, so that puts us on 60, which means we've made so far 80 bucks because we started on 80 exactly. Let's check the time. We still have enough time, I'd say, to go out for one more good hunt. We actually have about 20 minutes left to go on one more good hunt to finish this off and see how much we can make. Do you know what? I need I need bullets. I don't have bullets. So let me order some bullets. So we're going to get ourselves a raccoon on our last hunt. This time we're going to literally stay out here as long as possible. So we're going to be trying to put only the best carcasses on the animal this time. Because we are planning on being out here and maybe making ourselves 30, 40, hopefully even more in um uh, bucks on this occasion so we're looking only for the best carcasses this time because this is the last hunt and we're going to time it so that we go back just in time so that we can um sell everything up and see what we made within the hours we've got another rabbit here oh missed him why is it taking two shots on a rabbit that doesn't usually happen so we got ourselves a perfect condition rabbit here which is exactly what we're looking for perfect and we will be stowing this animal up because this is 350 in value as well, so that's a really good find. Hopefully we can get ourselves another rabbit, that'd be ideal. Lovely, we've got ourselves a perfect condition muskrat here, and the carcass on a muskrat is worth four bucks, as I, I don't know whether I've got one already in this video earlier on, it's been going a while now. 
Um, but yeah, it's four bucks on a perfect muskrat, so that's ideal. That's like the best like animal you can kind of get with a vermint rifle. One of the best anyway. So we'll pick that up for sure because we definitely want to take that back because that's four bucks. As well as the skin, we're probably making about six bucks off that muskrat alone. So we'll stole that up and let's get on with the hunt. Okay, we've got ourselves a buck here in front of us. Now this is an animal I want because it's worth a lot of money. If we're going to put something on the back, it's, it might as well be a buck. Don't know what condition it's in, but I don't care what condition I get it in, to be honest. It's still going to be worth more than anything else I can get. It's only in one star condition anyway, so... Which would be exactly what condition it would have been in by the time we're done with it as well. Alright, we've got it here now, so let's go ahead and kill it. And then we'll go ahead and skin it. So this is a decent animal, because a buck, to be honest with you, even in bad condition is one of the best animals you can get on the game if you get a perfect condition carcass on a buck it's 10 bucks but this one's going to be four bucks even for the poor condition carcass and as for the um skin we're going to get one pound one pound one dollar and 30 cents or so for that as well so overall this is going to that's that's five dollars there that we just got just for that buck alone all right, and we're arriving back for the last time. Let's check the time real fast. We're five minutes early, but I am still going to call it here. Another thing I want to mention when you're hunting that is so, like, such a good positive about this as well is you get yourself so much honor. If you can look at my honor now from when I started, I don't know if I showed that at the start, but I've gone up about maybe, I don't know, a good chunk, maybe like almost a quarter of honor as well, which is just another great bonus about this. Uh, we're going to go ahead and sell up now for the last time and see how we do. So let's sell up now. And as you can see, I've got a lot of stuff on this occasion. It stayed out for a little bit longer. And we lost a little bit of um, our money. We've gone down a bit, as you can see, because of the stable keep did hit us again. Anyway, with that being said, let's sell up. Now, we've got five minutes to sell this time, so we're not in a rush. We've got ourselves a few, what are these, uh, raccoon pads again. 360 for three of them. Perfect. We've got ourselves some meat, 175. The stringy meat doesn't really go for much. Rabbit pelts, 345 for three of them. That's awesome. That's a lot of cash. A uh, bit of meat there as well. That's from the buck. 240 for the game meat. The bird meat doesn't really sell for much. We've got ourselves two squid also. It's two bucks for them. Perfect opossum pelt, 90 cents. No good, not really. Not great at all. Buck antlers, another buck on that. A buck for a buck. Uh, we got ourselves perfect muskrat pelt. So that's two bucks there the perfect muskrat as you can tell is four bucks on his own so that's awesome we got ourselves a rabbit for 350 poor buck pelt which is 130 and the buck himself poor buck carcass which is four bucks in poor condition 10 bucks if you can get one of these in perfect condition so overall within that hour we've gone and made ourselves a hundred and fifty fifteen dollars one hundred and fifteen dollars Within an hour, actually under an hour, as you can see, we still got a couple of minutes to spare. I think that's great, guys. I think that is one of the best ways to make money on Red Dead Redemption 2. It also gives you honor. It also gives you XP. And it's also a lot of fun, in my opinion. And It's only going to get better. I'm going to find ways to make this so that it's $150 an hour kind of thing. And then we're going to be able to get some of the good stuff in the game before too long with just hunting alone. Anyway, I'm going to leave this video there because I've been going on for a long time. As you can imagine, even though I'm hopefully going to edit it down to something decent for you guys to watch. Um, I'm going to leave it there anyway. If you liked the video, like the video, subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for watching, as always, and take it easy.